Hidden Object Guru here, back for more Phantasmat 2, Crucible Peak. That's not how you say that word. We've just made it to the snow town on our snowmobile, and now we're going to uh, find all of the tools we... Sorry, um, uh, not on our snowmobile, to find the parts we need to fix the snowmobile. We came over here on an inflatable raft. This is where we need to put in a dollar. Which we will find somewhere. Wait, you came over there in an inflatable raft? Yeah. Like down a hill or something? No, across a lake. The lake's not frozen? No. Don't you remember there was the boat in the lake and everything? We had to pull the boat closer? The lake's not frozen at all. Weird. Nice. Ah, we've all been like that on books. Okay. That I have to thaw out. Oh, okay. I do have Kindle Unlimited. Ha ha! You do have Kindle Unlimited, Unlimited, famously. Where you can get my book, King of the Ching Chong Chinaman. A satire. A famous Western satire. Can I? No. Yay! 50 euro piece! 50 centimo euros. You know what I'm saying. Oh, it is a nice fountain, isn't it? Okay. Those steps are slick as a slalom run. And they're covered by weird ice figurines that are kind of creepy. And over here we've got a holder for a torch. Where to find a torch? Okay. We're going to find a route out of town, believe you me. We're going to hop on the snow machine and get out of here, and hopefully it doesn't turn out that secretly we were the seventh go sixth ghost all along. That was nice of the game. Okay, so I can't open that. I can't open this. All right, what do you think I should do, game? I can cut the chains? I've got bolt cutters. I, I did not realize these were bolt cutters. They're cutting pliers so they would work on chains as well. Yeah, of course they would. I was just thinking they could only be used as nail pullers for some reason. Nice. Oh. Honestly, I don't think it looks that creepy even without a uh, an eye. I think that looks like a super adorbs toy crocodile. And what goes in there? Circuit chip. Okay, well we can look for that too. Awaken Online Catharsis. Huh. Okay. So everybody, be sure to check out. We're getting a recommendation from Anime Freak. It's a book by... A guy's name who I've immediately forgotten. Travis Bagwell. And the first book is called... Awaken Online Catharsis. Oh, screw it. I'm bored. Yeah, just go ahead. It's... it's a, Like you said, it's free. So Well, not free. You There's are paying for it. There's a in my hand. Yeah, it's not hard for you to get, is what I'm saying. Alright, so I've got a barge pole, or boat hook if you prefer. Now I know what you're saying, uh, what you're thinking, those aren't mute, those aren't the same thing. Barge poles are technically different than boat hooks. And I would say, yes. But as a not boat person, does it really matter that much that I get this right? There are so many melting mini-games in this game, and none of them are entertaining to do. It's weird that this is like, this is the hill we're going to die on. Melting mini-games. I have no idea what the code is. So that was fun and useful. Uh, okay, what next? Oh, that's a tough choice. So it auto-completed the name Travis Bagwell. Yeah. But underneath that, it auto-completed to Travis McGee. Oh. And I was like, oh, Travis McGee. Yeah, Travis McGee is the best. What's wrong with the Tiger H in War Thunder? That's Miho's tank. I assume. I'm pretty sure hers is the Tiger 1H. You know, with the skirting around the top. It's awesome. What am I missing? Oh, can I use the barge pole as a as a uh, hook to get me up? No, yeah, that didn't make sense. Oh, right! I can use it to open the sewer! Of course. 
Oh no! Wait, I can't use the boat hook? Oh, a special hook to lift it. Damn! Six and up. That sounds nightmarish. Sorry, wait, what, what battle ranking is a uh, Tiger H? Alright, I'll take a hint again. I didn't want you to just tell me what the code was. I want to figure out what the code is myself. Why are you just telling me the code, and how was I supposed to know the code? That's weird, right? Oh, okay. So wait, six... If you're 5'7", why are 6.0 is able to one-shot you? That's ridiculous. Is there something wrong with the tank? Yes! I found the toy's eye! We're gonna go fix that crocodile. It's the last thing we do, everybody. Oiler. Where did we need the oiler? Oh, wait, that was a different game. Uh, note that during our avalanche, cr avalanche crisis on 2-17-2007, I took supplies from the market to give... Aww! Nice! Bud missing from the cash register, and it's the one that's used to open it. Gosh, darn it. Only we'll figure this out. Nice! Well, I hope I'm doing a better job than your Gibbs, because I don't know anything about your Gibbs. <laughs> Thank you for that pity laugh. Yes! A key! Also, with your Gibbs, it kind of sounds like that would be playing gory games. Because that's what they call the pieces that fly apart. When you explode a person in Quake, yeah. the little pieces that the person turns into are called Gibbs. Oh, interesting. Yeah. My voice is better. Thank you. Although I am a trained professional, so it would be weird if it wasn't. Although I don't know anything about your Gibbs. Your Gibbs might be a trained professional as well. That was a very reductive thing for me to say. All right, job one. We're looking for a but, bat. But the school you went to is probably better. <laughs> Such a mean thing for you to say. Uh, snow, what? Snowman, mermaid, so, pineapple, present to be anchor. Contentious about the good school you went to. <laughs> I know, right? It's terrible. Uh, okay. Ah, there we go. Anchor. Flower dress rabbit. Aha! Something else I have to do to unlock... Oh, there's the pineapple. So many cute things on this screen. I'm not allowed to cook on them. Darn right it is. There's a present? Fist. I want the present. Bat. Rabbit wheel. Well, there's the wheel. Oh, there's the present. Cute! Uh, what do we have? Oh, rabbit. It's a flower. Of rabbit. It says, it's oh, the yeah, it's totally. And there's the flower underneath the butterfly. Or butterfree, as I like to call them. That's everything. We did it, everybody. We got the cartwheel. I don't know why we wanted a cart, but we got the cartwheel. So, the, dreams, the dream is alive today. So, we're putting the wheel before the cart? Oh. <laughs> oh, you're making me sad. Thank you cringe. Uh, Greta wasn't kidding about the roof caves and cavens. No, she wasn't. Skizzers! Circuit ship I can't reach. What about my boat hook? I did read the description of the first book. I'm very intrigued. Nice. And I did buy it. But I decided Bought it not or did you get it for free? Well, you know. Okay, just making sure you didn't pay for it. No, I traded in one of my other kids. Oh, yeah, because you can only have so many checked out at a time, right? Yeah, it's weird. It was not a good book that I traded in. Well, that's fine, then. Yes, we can open the cash register. Cover the... Oh, okay, I'll go find a bucket to put that in. Weirdest question I got from a commenter. It's like, do you, uh... Did you buy all of your subscribers? Because, you know, normally... Like... Many of your streams only get like 50, 60 views, and yet you have 3,000 subscribers. What's going on with that? And I'm like, weird and hostile question, dude. Uh, but no. Well, people like playthroughs. No, um, it's mostly the reason I have subscribers is because, uh, what do you call it? Um, of my various guides. 
Yeah. Isn't that what I said? No, you said playthroughs. Oh, same. To me, My various same. game guides. Yeah. And yes, Girls in Panzer. Sorry, what am I supposed to... Press the buttons to change the color of the squares. Fill the entire game area with figures shown on screen. Yeah, but I'm trying to. You've been asked if you lift. No, I do not lift. Wait, what am I doing wrong here? He runs. I do run instead of lifting. I have a treadmill. And I... Okay, press the buttons to change the color of the squares. Fill the entire game area with the figures shown on screen. Can I only do red? Can you switch? And now I'm never going to get at those. See, when I try to do green... Wait. Oh, you can change the color of them by double-clicking on them. That's what happened up there because you clicked on those things twice, so they turned into blue. No, they're blue because they're blocked off. Oh, okay. Yeah. All right, well, if I could do this tuple, um, uh, If I could do this puzzle, it would take us the next ten minutes, so I'm just not going to do this puzzle. Okay. Like, now that I see what we're supposed to do... I realize I don't care. Apparently that's what it was supposed to look like at the end. A giant mess of nonsense. What? What are you doing to me, game? Oh my god. Let's go use the circuit board and the coins, everybody. Not necessarily in that order. I mean, definitely not in that order. Thank you. Yay! We can go on the ski lift, everybody! The dream is alive. Okay, choose the route of the gondola to get the station. Press go once you've selected the correct arrows. You must fill the column with arrows. So, the answer is... Left. Oh, no, wait. Reset. It's up. So I need, um, wait, let me just find how many we need. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So we need ten moves. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Yeah, that should do it. Uh, that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Oh, no, that's eleven. Hold on. Uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Damn it. Okay. Oh, I got it. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. No. Am I wrong about how this works? 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Oh, you have missed... Um, we were caught in an avalanche uh, while trying to ski an awesome mountain. And uh, then we got uh, trapped with the ghostly denizens of uh, who were killed in the last avalanche at this mountain. Okay, I did miscount. Um, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, got it. Two, uh, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And fun fact, I keep running into the, the ghostly people who don't know they're ghosts, of course, because where would be the fun in that? And they're constantly, like, they're constantly phasing in and out of existence, and my character is not addressing the fact that they are obviously ghosts. It's really weird. We are back to Phantasmat 2 Detective Assassin, as per your recommendation. On the weekend, we played a new uh, full-on horror one of these uh, hidden object game with DM, which I thought was pretty badass, and you'll expect to see more of that soon. But daily game, we're going to be wrapping up Phantasmat, and then who knows what we're going to be playing next. Probably Phantasmat 3, because that's the one I already own. Although they might be sending me the new Artifacts Monday game this week, and if so, uh, we're going to swap over to that, because it's Artifacts Monday, and I always prioritize those guys, because they do an amazing job. Uh, okay. If you get stuck in an avalanche, try to escape from it with jerks. 
Unfasten the ski snowboard ski pole since in the avalanche they would act like anchors. If you fall, try to stay on the snow surface as long as possible. When completely covered with snow, try to make a cavity for breathing. Obviously, as soon as the avalanche stops, clear your nose and mouth some snow. Okay. Stay calm and try to believe that help will come soon. Uh, of course, the best thing to do would be to uh, hollow out your ski pole and turn it into a pipe, right? And then stuff a piece of red cloth into the pipe and then push it out through the snow and then blow on it so the, like, the flag goes out and the rescuers can find you. And if you know what that's a reference to, be the first commenter below the video to mention it and you will win a prize. Just drop it into the comment section below the video along with the time code for wearing this quiz. I asked the question. Yeah, it was a weird description there. Oops, I meant to do that. It's a shame the cup shattered. That's weird. Yeah, can I not turn it? I got snowboard boots. I got a mask and goggles. I've got oil. Why can I not get this snowboard? Something stuck. I should check the cable out. Oh, okay. The wheel is rusted. Well, I just found an oiler. That's right. I just transformed the entire rusted shut wheel into a, a beautiful new wheel with that tiny oiler. Oh, I'm sorry to hear you're sick, uh, detective. Well, I don't know that you're home free. You're going to a gondola station. Jerky is delicious. No, jerky's the best. Yeah. Yeah. Everyone that, agrees with that. that. salmon jerky? Oh my god, that salmon jerky's we, the best. We got that for, for Chinese New Year. We'll go back and get some, Yay! yeah. Yeah, we got a Chinese grocery nearby that sells... I'm so confused. Uh, sells... Turk, uh, salmon jerky and it is the best. It's fantastic. Also, we're sorry to hear you were sick. Yes, please feel better. Oh, I was supposed to open it up and toss down a staircase. That is a lot of snow. Put on my goggles. That should help. Oh, we're having another flashback to the accident that started all of this. There's a slight chance our character might also be dead and just not know it yet. Because it was a very catastrophic avalanche he was stuck in. Hmm. Also, um, there was a famous pyromaniac living in the town. And there's a slight chance the pyromaniac has turned to fetishizing uh, avalanches and been detonating them with nitroglycerin. That is one of the plot threads. See? The mountaintop where the this is what I'm talking is. about. Welcome to my shop. People mysteriously appearing in a cloud of blue smoke. It's weird. Oh. The door to Schultz's store. Gotcha. Hey, Schultz. You've reached the mountaintop where the... Alright, so we already... Uh... Interesting. I have never had kangaroo jerky. I've never had kangaroo meat. I've had a kangaroo burger and I thought it was tasty. No. Uh, yes. As someone who doesn't oh, really eat much meat except for fish, hmm. I can't find my key. You see, I'm a ghost now. Yeah, it is... It is a good thing to have as just a snack ready to go. I completely agree with that. Have I have had turkey jerky plenty of times. Suit. And it was pretty or good. I could have dropped it. If I dropped it, we're never getting into that store ever. It's find such it. a good hiking. I'll look snack. in the forest. It is the best you hiking. You check snack. the ski I agree with that. No, jerky's wonderful. I have found a branch, haven't I? Thanks for uh, thanks for telling me that, though. Uh, let's check out the ski run. Okay. Then I'm very excited to check out Phantasmat 5. Well, here's the skier and too far to walk, so I'll hop on this. GAH! Is no one concerned about the corpses lying around this place? Looks like I found a survivor. The avalanche keeper, beeper, caught a signal. He's somewhere under the snow near the ski run. I need to get the beeper closer. I'll finish what he started. Damn right I will. Can I, like, cut him loose? Because this is really creepy. 
I cannot cut him loose. Okay, good to know. Yeah, oh, you want me to snowboard down. I get it. Isn't this what got me into trouble, like, five minutes ago? Venison jerky is good. Really? Yeah, poker, you've never had venison jerky. No. Not a venison person. I, I, I think a, deers are too adorbs. I have, a, I have a friend that used to bow hunt before he turned to wildlife photography and well, friend's father, but still. Even and, still. Uh, I used to trade fresh caught fish for medicine. It's a good trip. It's a good deal. Right? So while that guy's buried under the snow and yes, dying... I was uh, busy making a snowman because only by doing that could I find the snow shovel that allowed me to dig him out. Because everything about this makes sense. Oh, he's long dead. Don't eat. Uh, don't. Don't play. <laughs> I'm sorry. I just love. Oh my God, he's a dead man. I've been chatting up a ghost. Yeah, that's why he appeared in the form of a cloud of blue smoke that materialized in front of you. Gator is good. Really. Also. Assassin said, don't play Phantasmat 5 while eating snacks. Oh, apparently it's disgusting. I would not have guessed that. Wow. Wait, how am I back? Oh, right, now I'm at the back at the bottom of the run. I get it. Okay. I now understand where I am in reference to the thing. Can Does I walk over to the run? character have that cool, like, avalanche safety thingy? What do you mean? Jacket? Yeah, that beeps the, the, if they can find you. And, and the, it, they also have a rebreather. No, not that. So you're that. buried, you put it in your mouth, and you can breathe while buried under the snow. It's so freaking Badass. Cool. All right. Oh, I kept the snow shovel. That's weird. Sorry, Schultz. Turns out you've been murdered. Murdered by man's it oldest foe. On the ski I snow. Have snow board descent was I wasn't exhilarating. particularly fond of it. Cow... I don't know what you I mean about seeing. Food. I have years That's and years and years ago really? in a Vietnamese I'm restaurant. I was not a fan. It's a fine hey, camera, what's the French and on it are about? images I took just as the avalanche hit. That's the kind of thing they eat. Is what they're saying. Low. Oh. oh no! I thought that was torture. You can recharge it at the meteorological <laughs> station. There's a computer. You're talking about Quebecois. Oh, you meant actual French. Yeah, food. real Getting French. The station could be Quebecois. a bit tricky, though. You'll have to head through the forest over the mountaintop. Oh, I will. Follow the path. It zigzags around. Go right, then left, then straight for a bit. It's not then another wait, 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 wait. Right, left, left, straight, right, left. Right, left, straight, right, left. So, okay. about Phantasm at 5, he said it's not saw disgusting, but it makes you feel weak and nervous. I will remember that. Kind of how you feel while watching a surgery. Ew. Ugh. I'm not going to be playing that one for a while. Hey, hidden objects. All right, let's do this. So, we need a power bar. Do you need a thermometer? Because I found the thermometer. They call power bars power strips in Europe. Lighter. Rocket. Lemon. This is a ridiculously convoluted screen. It really is. Do you need a rubber ducky? I don't. That was one of the first things I saw, too. Such a cute rubber ducky. Is that a lighter? No, that's a harmonica. Okay, oh, the lighter's over underneath the rubber ducky. Is it? Oh, yeah, there it is. That is a great thing to do. What's a great thing to do? Just be willing to try foods. I am also willing to try foods. I would Honestly. suggest you uh, drop by the Hidden Object Guru Discord channel, because then you can get the recipes I post there. Oh, yeah, that's true. Yeah. Hey, yeah. What is a drop? Seriously, does anyone know what a drop is? Gumdrops? Do you think? I don't know. I'm trying to think of things with Well, the there's a drop. phone. I need a wolf, a drop, and a fish. Oh, the fish is... I know what two of those things on, are. See where the harmonica is? Yeah. Oh, yeah, no, it's a fish skeleton. They count that. Oh, good. I will add more recipes. I just wrote up the recipe for my, lasa my much-celebrated lasagna, so... Everybody, go out and try that. We have to figure out what they mean by the word drop. Maybe they mean yelp lemon drop. Oh, it's a drop of water. Oh. 
Oh, you know, it's there under the tube. Yeah, no, no, I see it now. Okay, I okay. Weirdly, I call those droplets. Thank you. Merci beaucoup. Recipes are the best. I strangely don't have recipes because I never cook from a recipe. No, you just cook. Yeah, I just cook. Follow the path. It zigzags around. Go right, then left, then straight for a bit, then another right, and another left. So that's right, left, straight, right, left. Okay, right, left, straight, right, left. And I've got a power bar for some reason. You don't know why I needed a power I like, bar. I like trying new foods, but I have a ton of food allergies. That is a problem. So I'm super paranoid about trying new foods unless I know exactly what's in them. So the answer is right, left, straight, right, left. And every time I try, like, fruit I've, I've never had before, i.e., say, from Oh, my country, God! I, it turns out I'm allergic to it, so now I'm super Creepy paranoid. observatory. Nice. And an antenna. Antenna. And a cliff. A crater was formed as the result of an explosion. The rescuers were right. The avalanche was caused by an explosion. I should take a photograph of this. Oh, right, I have to charge it with the USB cable before I can do that. Gordon Ramsay's not bad. I kind of like Jamie Oliver. Jamie Oliver is interesting. Because I find his food is a little more healthy than Gordon Ramsay, and he's willing to try different things. That's true. Whereas I only ever cook very basic things other than lasagna and uh, cheesecake. And my various cookie recipes. And, and your guacamole. Your well, guacamole. of course my guacamole. But I mean, anyone can cook guacamole. Oh, it's, it's you know. super easy. Get, get yourself a bunch of avocados. Make a diced up thing of onions, tomatoes, and jalapeno peppers. Oh. Stir them together. You're done. My grandmother made better food than my mother did. That's true. <laughs> and you never had I never met it, but I've food. heard the stories. Actually, my grandmother was a great baker. My other grandmother, who you did meet before, you know, she lost her marbles, was a fantastic cook. Nice. Yeah, um, cheesecake is great. Uh, I think the cheesecake I make has... I think it only has one or two eggs, but it has uh, just a teensy pinch of flour, a tiny pinch of flour, but oh my god, so much dairy. Oh, wow. Like... You've got all uh, you've got the ridiculous amount of uh, cream cheese. You've got the ridiculous amount of roasted vegetable soup. Does sound good. Uh, what do you call it? Ridiculous amount of cream cheese. Ridiculous amount of sour cream. Just, just nuts for dairy. Is there something else to pick up here? Can I get another torch? There's a clock and over it's there. Flour. Not real flour. Well, of course, yeah. Uh, no, this kind of cheesecake just has the slightest amount of flour in it. It's just to make sure it, it sets the right way. It is not very much flour, and it's still gluten-free because you can use uh, rice flour without causing any trouble at all. I found problems sometimes with getting it to set if I don't use at least like a quarter cup of flour. Dig out the butane torch at the explosion site at the mountaintop is what they want me to do. Why would I think to do that? <laughs> like, when I click on stuff here, the only command is... Oh. I was supposed to click on the pile of ash and somehow guess that there would be yet another butane torch. We find a lot of butane torches in this game. You know, it would make more sense if we kept the butane torch and we just kept finding uh, canisters for it. Wow, this I is the first time it's worked well. Frog soup in literally years. What soup? Frog leg. Hmm. Uh, that's tough to say. I actually really enjoyed Phantasmat 1. I don't want to weigh in on which one is better until I've played them both. Both of them don't have maps and have a lot of backtracking, so I'm kind of weirdly prejudiced about that. Neither one of them has a good hint system. Uh, nice. Let's do that. Come on, seismograph. Let me know what the code is. Oh, so 2007. Zero, zero, seven. 87.5 FM. Okay, let's check it out. Haunted Hotel 16? You mean Haunted Hotel, uh... 
Lost Dreams or whatever it was called. That was pretty good. I think 17 was better, and I think 15 was better. I don't think it was as good as those other two, but it was a solid game. And it had some truly weird monsters, which I liked. Ooh. Oh, okay. How do I turn on the computer? Oh, okay. So I have to go access the plug somewhere? Ah, there we go. And that's why we needed the power bar. Okay. That Wait. That was really good. I'm totally stealing that recipe. Beyond the Page was the new one. Yes, that's 17. 17's good. I really enjoyed that one. Yeah, I thought Beyond the Page was really just solid gold. Is that the one you most recently played? Yeah, the one with the killer spiders. Oh, yeah, that one was good. How do I log in? Every time I hear my song on the radio is the hint for the password. Uh, okay, let's go back and check out the radio. The radio's US... not in the same room? No, it's back in the store. I hear you. Alright. Oh, wait. Oh, the antenna, right. Radio frequency. We got it. Yeah, the last uh, hit, uh, Haunted Hotel game was just loaded with uh, killer spiders. 2557 is the password. Killer spiders from beyond the moon. 2557. Oh, he's hitting the correct keys in the keyboard. That's nice. Okay. Wait a minute. This is my skiing. I must be one of the ghosts, and this must be my camera! Oh no, this was his. It's just they keep using the same footage over and over again for the skiing. So you know. Uh, in, in, in all honesty, as someone who skis... And to skiing all looks the same, yes, I, I understand. It's snow, yeah. it all looks Wow. See, I haven't played Dark Parables 7 yet. I'm waiting to get into that series until I've cleaned up my remarkable backlog of hidden object games. Do, 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 do. Uh, okay, where are we going? Uh, okay, we've got that. We've got this. Wait, why do I need the camera? It's my camera. So it must be my fault. Oh, he's gone mad. You say there was an explosion? I wanted the ultimate thrill. To ski the crest of an avalanche. I'm to blame. There was no explosion. I would also put lemon pepper in all if my If there was an explosion, was where's your evidence? Do you have a photo of that? Wait, this guy caused an avalanche? So he could try and ski down in the crest of an avalanche? Like it was a wave and he was surfing? That's not how avalanches work. No, but I think this man murdered a town because he saw the movie Triple X. Yeah? What is... I've never seen that word before, so I'm not going to weigh in. What is wrong with this guy? Ah, oh, what a relief to know it wasn't my fault. The guilt was killing me. It wasn't? Then who set off the explosion? Go on and repair your snowmobile. Help yourself to parts in my store. Oh, but the battery's low. What do you mean by disaster stories? There's only one place in town to charge it. Where's that? that? Would be the ice sculpture gallery. There's a powerful generator there. Okay. Well, help finance that gallery. Ask her how to get in. That does sound like a great idea. You could pop that into the recipe section. And if you want to leave the recipe for the soup there too, boom. That sounds interesting. And also, generator, ice sculpture, yeah, pictures, are, pictures of food are fun. It's true. Food photography is always a thing. 
I'm so sorry. That was a loud yawn, and I apologize. Swoosh, swoosh, swoosh. All right, so uh, let's go back and talk to Greta. Doing a lot of traveling back and forth. Okay. Towns getting destroyed. And oh, that kind of disaster. Okay. Yeah, when they said dark parables, I'm like, I assume that it was uh, related to, uh, you know, fairy tales and whatnot. Sorry, does Greta not... Is she not the hotel lady? Oh, I was supposed to look for the, ho the snowmobile parts first. Okay, well that was embarrassing. Let's head back up to Schultz's store. Don't tell anybody that happened. Oh my god, this is embarrassing. Such a long schlep back. Wow. Chebruak. Making Russian food, huh? Now see, that's food I don't think I've ever had. Plenty of Hungarian food. But no Russian food. Exclamation mark. Oh my god! We're back to a location the second time and the items have stayed gone. So now we get to pick up the rubber duck. Cool. That's fantastic. So few games do this. Oh, I mean, most games these days, you only go to screens once, but still. Yeah, I know. I like way to go. Screens. Now, when you say snowmobile parts, what the H and do those look the like? the items we already picked up stayed gone. So I have a fist, and I need to do something with this fist to get the knife. I have to smash the fist into ice to get oh, the knife. Hilarious. Those are obviously the snowmobile oh, parts. That was pretty great. Okay, headphones. Or telephones for your head. In case you're not familiar with that term, headphones. Okay. So it's like a telephone, but just for your ears. Could those be headphones underneath the gloves? Yeah. Oh, they're earbuds. Yeah. Oh. I was looking for, you know, headphone, headphones. I, I understood. No, that was my bad. There's the fly. Uh, giraffe, laces. There's the laces. Oh, the cassettes on the right hand bottom. Line. Yep. Merci beaucoup. Uh, okay, we've got traffic rod. What is a traffic rod? I've never heard that term before. Okay, does anybody know what a traffic rod is? Is it this? It's this. Oh, it's one of those stanchions that's colored. Oh, okay. I like making food from everywhere. Yeah, I can see that. Uh, giraffe rainbow. You'd think it wouldn't be hard to find a giraffe. I don't know if I've it should been be wrong. Fruit food, there it is. But I've been trading like recipes and cooking tips with one of my russian co-workers are bialis russian then i have made bialis just based on the sound of the word biali i thought it might be russian yes you're correct Merci beaucoup is french that's true we did it everybody we got the snowmobile parts and they're like remember you got to charge your snowmobile parts in the ice sculpture gallery because I guess the snowmobile parts include power tools? It is the retreating language? Burn! <laughs> Such a mean thing to say about the French. Holy. I just like, they retreat for one war, and that it's somehow makes up for the oh, wait, you didn't 700 the years of being belligerent jerks all over Europe. <laughs> uh, my sculpture. Okay, if can I see? Get it ready and open. It'll attract guests to the resort. Hopefully but living ones, but I wouldn't I guarantee know that. I don't how to get there anymore. The avalanche buried that part of town. You fool! You foolish fool! Poor Otto. He was our pyrotechnics guy. I think he found a way in after the avalanche. Loving her accent. All right, which one was Otto? Such severe loading time. Free screen. Okay, this was not auto. Man, France used to love wars, and they did great. And then, boom, World War II. They got their asses kicked, and that's all they've been hearing ever since. So where is auto, hint button? What? Oh, okay, well, now we've got to do snowmobile stuff again. 
They keep giving me conflicting directions. Like, go talk to her about the ice sculptures. Actually, you're supposed to get the snowmobile parts. Okay, well, go and do the... Go and do the snowmobile part. Uh, sorry. Uh, go and find Otto to get into the place. Oh, now you're supposed to, uh, deal with the... Ah, oh, there we go. We got the battery. Now you're supposed to deal with the snowmobile first. Well, just let me do that before I go and talk to her, then. See what I'm saying? Yay! Hidden object scene! Alright. Well, in Rome, uh, I think Rome, it kind of helps Rome out that they were there for, you know, hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of years. So that's a screw, not a screwdriver. Oh, hello, duct tape. I wonder how my treadmill's doing. Ah, I'm sure so, it's fine. So, did they mean that thing, the, like, the, the, the decorative wooden knot thing above the glove as the wooden snowflake? That did not look like a wooden snowflake to me. That would have taken me forever to get around to guessing I, that. Thank you for that one. You're welcome. Spidey! Hey, Spidey. Uh, there's a key. Uh, where's the glue? Do you need a drill? No. You don't need a lock. Ah, oh, there's the glue. I need an oiler. Pencil, a clasp. Uh, okay. Well, the oiler's in yellow, so you have to do something. Oh, do they mean the the vice down there? Is that the vice? No. no. Good guess. But that was not a clasp this time. There's the oiler, and there's the feather literally next to it. Uh, okay, lighter is to the left, you say. Oh, yeah, there it is. Thank you. All right. Uh, so a pencil and a clasp, and we're out of here. Not a fan of spiders? Turns out many people aren't. Yeah. Get it. Alright. I am the official spider remover at work. Is, no, that's not a clasp. Far from it. So I need a pencil and a clasp. I'm going to do that thing where I walk up to the screen and have a better look. What about the S hook? I oh, I found the pencil. The, uh, measuring tape. Could that be a clasp? Let's find out. Oh, no, wait. Above the red paint. Yep, it's a carabiner. They meant carabiner. There we go. Yay! Glue is definitely a thing I knew I needed. Hello, oh, Otto's back. You're looking for Otto. No, this is He's Steve. In the church. Yeah, no. Spiders are unnerving. I think everyone would agree with that. That's the uh, terrible absent father of the pyromaniac by the way just fyi that's why he buried the town in snow to get rid of his uh, absent dad i don't think it worked very well because his dad stuck around as a ghost snowflake tiger club that is not a tiger this is a tiger oh we get to click on the cow this the time on the right uh, on the top yes corner. got it Oh, on the stamp? On the oh, yeah. No, there's Lincoln. Merci beaucoup. Uh, I'm looking for a cactus. All right, I need a club. I assume you mean this thing. You did. Need a star. Weird that one of the suits wasn't stars. I feel like if you had subbed in stars for diamonds when they were inventing card suits, no oh, one would have batted an eye. Yeah, no, I had it. Uh, or am I crazy? Was that a Is that a ridiculous thing to assert? Like, five of stars. Queen of stars. I feel like that would have just fit right in there. With uh, hearts and clubs and spades. Is that oh, like a knife a I can... Uh, oh, yeah. Thank yeah. you. Uh, I was so focused on the wine glass, I forgot we needed another item. Uh, I feel like I was supposed to cut this patch off, but now I realize, no, we just clicked on something on that earlier to get it. So there's something we need to you move. Something with the umbrella? No, that was my first what guess, too. Fragile tape. No, it can't pull that loose. I thought we had to do something with one of the packages. Can you undo the, the, the leather case with the bulldog on it? That thing? guy? Nope. Okay, watch. Anybody have any ideas? What we could click on or open or what? None of these pictures. Wait, wait, wait. No. Oh, there it is. 
You have to pull up the corner. You can click on the uh, tape. You pick up next to the corner. I am the same way, uh, anime. I also do not measure things when cooking. It's why I'm not a good baker. That's exactly why. Stuff does not raise right if you don't get the measurements yeah. right. As you well know. But when you're cooking, you can just cook to taste. It's true. It's awesome. Yeah, I mean, especially when you're making soup. I think it's very forgiving when you're making soup. Oh, right, I still need a bucket for all that snow. Uh, sorry, all that grit to throw on the ice. Oh, Jesus, the opening cutscene is about someone being drowned in a well? Yikes. That is roof. Oh, right, the, I forgot about the cup in the ski gondola. Yeah, snakes are pretty cool. When I was a kid, we used to chase snakes. Well, Aww. first we chased frogs. And then we had, we had a cottage on an island, and then the snakes moved in and ate all the frogs, and we chased frogs. Snakes. Uh, snakes, rather. Oh, I see. So I have to put all of the regular pieces in, and then I can turn the cup. Okay, so I guess we need this one. Yep. And That's then... kind of cool. I like this game. Yeah, it's not a bad puzzle. No. Uh, this one? All right, so now I need this super spiky guy here, this little weird guy here, and that bad boy right there. And then you turn it enough, and you're going to get to put the uh, handle on. I get it. And the next side. That is a really cool way to design a jigsaw puzzle, guys. Very neat. I have not seen a specific kind of jigsaw before. It's even fairly accurate to might how you might uh, fix a mug. Yay, I we did like it! If you had a snake, a spider, and a bird all at the same time, it would be like that whole the old lady who ate a fly. Yeah, they would just Song cause trouble for each of, other. Like, ev did everything just eat one another? Oh no! I'm sorry to hear that. All right. Steps. Prepare to get salted. Okay, we did it. We made it to the church, which is where everybody hid out during the avalanche, although fat lot of good it did them. Aww, so, this is where we're going to take a break for, uh, that's a good name for a puppy. Uh, take a break from uh, Phantasmat Chapter 2, Part 2. Uh, actually, Part 2 suggests that this is a sequel. It's not. Phantasmat 2 Crucible Peak, where we're still trying to find out who blew up the mountain. And they're saying the skier didn't do it, even though he really wanted to ride an avalanche. So I don't know how that exonerates him, but whatevs. I've been the Hidden Object Guru. Thanks for coming on this journey with me. If you had a good time and you'd like to see more, there's buttons for that. Questions, suggestions, related whatnots, go in the comments section below the video. If you'd like to be here for the live stream where these games get played, check out the Discord channel. That is where I announce them. I'll see you back here for more new and upcoming games, but until then, au revoir.